So, what can I say about this card? Let me say about it. It's amazing. A compulse and a one card pendulum scale built into one. Oh, you have no excuse running this card in a pure dynamis build. That's all it sums up. Anyways, what's going on, guys? Today I want to talk to you all about this new card that's coming out in Maximum Crisis. It's an interesting card, and it basically it basically spells consistency for Dynamist. The trap card is called Dynamist Howling. Basically what it does, the first ability allows you to add two Dynamist Pendulum scales. Doesn't matter whether they're the same scale, two different scales, or low scales. But in many cases, since you are going to be relying on OTKs, yeah, you need two different scales in order to spam them out. The first effect is really unique. The second effect, well, it, it's kind of... Eh, okay. When it's already face up on the field, and say if you already had one, you already activated it, and you wanted to activate another. Tribute to Dynamist on your side. Pretty good. Works well with Dynamist Charge. Target one card on your opponent's side of the field, or on yours, and then you can add it back to the hand. A compulsive. And the cool thing is, it basically gives more spot removal to the deck. So say if you wanted to run the Draco Slayer engine, which is still pretty good to this day, even though with Draco Faceoff being at 1 and Luster Pendulum being at 1, it loses some leverage there, but you still have the consistency with the Masters and the Vectors if you um, want to go that, down that route. Or if you want to run a pure Dynamis build, which I will go towards when this card comes out. Guaranteed, this is going to be a main deck card. A lot of people are going to probably be running this in spades, so you basically have no excuse making a pure archetype of this deck. I would rate this card a 9 out of... Well, if you were to give the deck overall, including this card, a rating, it would be maybe a 9 out of 10, only because... They should have given the spot removal support sooner rather than later. To my surprise, I'm actually shocked they didn't make another Pendulum Monster like Dynamis Raptor and it allowed them to do some crazy stuff like fetch out maybe two Dynamis at, in one shot just by normal summoning it or whatever. But Dynamis Howling, it's one of these new support cards that taste the cake. It supports this deck really well. I guarantee you. I, I guarantee you this card's going to be really, really good when it comes out in Maximum Crisis. But anyways, guys, hope you all enjoyed this card review. Please let me know what you want me to review next. I'm probably going to not do a card review until, like, after the ban list, but guarantee you'll see more deck profiles. So until then, hit me up. Don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, this is Smash Adams signing out.